All right, well, there's the Warriors and Lakers NorCal, NorCal SoCal rivalry on the court. Coincidentally, that rivalry from the north to the south is also happening on the pitch, and it takes center stage this weekend at Levi Stadium when the San Jose Earthquakes take on LAFC, both ranked in the top five, by the way, in the Western Conference. So joining me right now in studio is former Earthquake Shay Salinas, who is also the club's all-time assist leader. I hear you're pretty good. Uh, yeah, I used to be. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for hanging out with us. You know, I this is going to be a really fun matchup, and you guys are playing at Levi's, which will make it even a little bit more intense. So tell me a little bit about why this is a rivalry and yeah. all the hype. Massive game this weekend. LAFC is in first place. We're undefeated at home. And it's going to be at Levi Stadium where the World Cup will be held in 2026. So we're looking to have over 40,000 fans there this weekend. Uh, largest Cinco de Mayo party on the West Coast. It's going to be a big one. It is. And I think what's so interesting about this, too, is there's so much interest in soccer globally. It's yep. huge internationally, football, as they call yeah. it. But here in the States, I feel like we're a little behind sometimes, not when it comes to kids, but as we go professional here, as we watch right. our professional teams. Why is that? And what can we do better? Yeah, you're right. Youth soccer is massive here in the States. Almost every kid nowadays plays youth soccer. As they get older, there's so many different sports to choose from. You saw Golden State Warriors are doing well. We've got a lot of football uh, interest, baseball interest. So drawing attention to soccer at older age groups is difficult. But we're hoping to change that leading into the World Cup. I think this is a big step in that. Uh, and I think it's going to be an exciting, it's going to be a party this, this weekend. Uh, there's music, there's dancers, there's a halftime show, there's a flyover. It's going to be a really fun event. It sounds like something you would take all your friends and family, just have yeah. a good time. All right, so I'm going to take you out to the front of the desk here because you, I didn't know this, but apparently you got a lot of moves. Yeah, I heard you learned how to dance today. <laughs> I, I can show you the dance. Teach, you I'll teach, not gonna, I'll teach I, you how to juggle. Okay, you teach okay. me how to dance. You, uh, fair enough. All right, so fair juggling enough. is just keeping the ball in the air with okay. your feet. You want to use your laces. And I was a horrible juggler and had to practice it a lot. And then I started learning some tricks. And that's good to know because I think kids, wow. <laughs> that, you know, we're just getting started. insurance? You I don't want you to. Practice makes perfect. Do you want to try a kick and catch? Okay. What, you mean catch it with, like your with hands, my hands? Kick it and catch it. Okay. You got okay. This. All right. Come Watch on. out. Okay. Watch out, cameras. I, cameras, sorry. Oh, that was pretty you good. You catch it, Shay. That was pretty good. That was very <laughs> Not as good. good as you. I hear you're a little grumpy too, like uh, uh, Roy Kent from Ted Lasso. Right. I was. That's the, the word. I just retired. I was the oldest kid on the oldest player on the team. Uh, and I was starting to become like Roy Kent. I cuss a lot less, though. Good. Yeah. Glad to hear it. Don't do any of that here. Okay, tell everyone where, like, about the event, where they can find information, if they want to take their friends and family this yeah, weekend. Yeah, absolutely. May 6th, so this Saturday, against LAFC at Levi Stadium. But FanFest starts at 1.30, so you want to get there early. There's a ton of pregame activities. Game starts at 4.30. You can find all the information at sjearthquakes.com. And you guys are undefeated at home. Yeah, we're undefeated at home, and they are undefeated. So this is a big clash against LAFC, uh, and winner hopefully leads on to the playoffs and, and big game, big time this year. And so once this game has wrapped, how many more games do you guys have in the regular season here? There's still quite a few games. We're early in the season. Um, there's a 32-game season. We're about seven games in, so still a long way to go. The summer months are difficult. Uh, there's a lot of travel, but this game should give us some momentum going into that. All right. Well, everyone, hopefully you're going to get out there and cheer on our earthquakes. Yeah. It sounds like it's going to be a blast, not just for this game, but for the whole season. Yeah, absolutely. We'll see you guys on Saturday. Absolutely. Want to try again? Okay. All right. We're going to toss to you, Jess. I'm going to practice my soccer skills over here. <laughs>